Hi all of you. In our third part of uh, Autodoc tutorials, we are going to see how to prepare our protein for docking by using Autodoc 4.2.6. For this, the prepared or cleaned protein which we have did in uh, part 2, we are going to use that uh, fix part of the protein. And with the help of Autodoc 4.2.6, the software or the tools, we are going to prepare our protein. Once you open Autodoc tools, the user face, user interface is going to look like this. The very first step what we have to do while performing docking is we have to set the preferences. Go to file, preferences and set. Here we are going to change the startup directory. I am going to open my working folder and here I am going to copy the address and I am about to paste that here and then set and make default. You have to perform this in the very beginning of the using Autodoc. Then only you can use without any errors. And next, let us start preparing our protein. Go to file, read molecule, and your final working folder will open directly. Select the cleaned protein and open. This is our cleaned protein. And for preparing this to Autodoc, I am going to add hydrogens by going into edit, hydrogens, add. I am going to add only polar hydrogens because only polar hydrogens will give charge to the protein and I am not going to change the method and any other options. Okay. You can see white color hydrogens were added and next step I am going to add charges. So go to edit, charges and add Coleman charges. Some amount of charges will be added and press OK. Now you are going to save your protein in PDB QT format by pressing grid, macromolecule, choose, choose your molecule and select molecule. It will ask to save in PDB QT format. So you are going to give extension dot P D B Q T. Q stands for charge and T stands for the time. And we are going to save our structure that is protein in this PDB QT format. Once it was saved, the color of the protein is changed, which means that our protein was prepared for our autodoc. So with this, we have completed preparation of protein. By the end of this tutorial, your final working folder should have an additional, one more additional item that is our protein, cleaned protein in PDB QT format. And in our next tutorial, we are going to see how to prepare a ligand.